gosh, I'm Sven playing some Penny. Beautiful. Apparently this thing closes because it's to close off the viz portals. Apparently I missed the key way over the other side of town. So the choice is before me. Do I want to go to the other side of town and grab the key? Or do I want to carry on here, which I can't because I got no key? Well, also, if you want, you can climb up on this thing by the dead man and the other dead man. <laughs> here, which reminds me of a thing in Silly Sinland. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Darn it and blast and curse it. Oh, blast and curse it. Oh, one gold. Oh, and not even a 1996 coin. So it's grubby. That's pretty funny, though. You get all the way up here and it's like, oh, one coin. No, get lost. Oh, and I guess this is my uh, broken, busted equipment. It's pretty cute. That arrow's broken in two places. What? What? There's this door? Do I really? Did I re What? What? <laughs> Fen! Fen! What is wrong with you, Fen? Well, I kill people and I eat hands. That's- that's two things. Also, I make a lot of noise. That's another thing. And really the main one, you might argue. Smith! Jodrick. Uh, I will pray for your sword when you deliver it into my hands and not before. Says you it is risky, but says I it is worse to be in my debt. I'll even pay you in good silver to keep quiet. Can't say- that's the worst looking eye, it looks like a backwards apostrophe. Can't say I am no gentleman. If you're so afraid of the bailiff, well, then hang yourself now, because he don't like no debtors neither. But better yet, make me my sword and hide it until our meeting. I remain your friend, Mifflins. Oh, that's just adorable. Well, that's a saw, not a sword. They both start with S and so therefore they can both be used in the name of brothel town but uh oh there's a thief yeah uh, thank you I hate to disturb your slumber or do i okay well i guess whatever the heck i got in here equipment is whatever the heck i got in here unless there may be some sort of roof trap door. I mean, who knows? Or maybe just an attic? Oh, it's just an attic. Well, still. Attics? I like attics. No problem. Wouldn't kick that out of bed for whatever the kids in the hall said. Hmm. Okay. Okay, so it's Equipmentville and also some crates if I happen to want to stack some crates, which... You know, maybe I do. Maybe, you know... May you know, but no, that's jumping from the roof. I don't know. I, f I thought maybe I could stack them to get up into that one place that I was trying to get up, but I barely remember what I'm even talking about. But it's a simple key. The keysmith had a simple key to this place. I'm afraid I'm not following the story, as I can't pay attention when I'm trying to talk and ply and stuff. Whatever. I'm trying to find that sewer place. Is it here? Uh, I think it might be here. Jesus, going all the way back because of some scatterbrained foolishness. Ay, 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 yes, there's a key here. It's way on that other side, kind of hard to see. It's the power station key. Well, I don't know where the hell the power station is, but I guess I'll just try doors until I try doors. There's a body, there's a door, which might be the one with weird sounds coming from it, or that could be the one down here. I want to get into this door, you know? I mean, it looks intriguing. No. This is the door with weird sounds coming from it. I mean... I mean, doesn't that door just make you want to barge right in? Face the trolls head on and tell them why you haven't gotten into a relationship yet. They'll be so justified out of their minds, they'll just blow their brains all over the concrete. And all the goats can live in paradise once more. So that's another gate. Like, I'm thinking I gotta get over that one, but it must have to be through a window because I don't see no stuff. So basically, I'm thinking this ledge up here. Wait a minute, maybe I could just jump? If I'm careful. No, maybe not, but like, yeah, but I'd be jumping from a slanted roof, so I couldn't really stack crates there. I don't reckon. There's probably nothing there anyway, but a plant pot. I don't want a wee, not a plant pot from like 2006. Yeah! It just looks like you could jump, but there's no goddamn length to the jump at all. It's... Oh, there is. Never mind, there must be a coin or something in this plant pot. Wait a minute. So I could take the whole plant pot. <laughs> Great. But really? 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 It's just like, hey, here's a plant pot, her, her, her. Hey, here's a plant pot, her, her, her. Can I climb this? Eh, grumpy old man time. Yeah. Really? What? A tease? God. Break and die, plant pot. That's so weird. Oh, I think they're, I think they're, uh, they're making it so that holding forward and, like, basically strafe running makes you go slower and strafe jumping too or something, maybe. I don't know. So I managed to get up here by some strange stroke of 
fortunate climbing or something, so let's see if I can't get over the wall this way. No, I guess not. Unless... I can... Oh, man. Yeah. This... Pretty cool. And that... Might lead me through the wall. Like, not bleed unlikely, but hey. Maybe I could get up. Wait a minute. Am I really supp- No, I'm not. Dang it. Power station key. Well, there's power thingies everywhere. This is probably the power station, isn't it? Yeah. So, never mind. Oh my god. If I missed something in here, feel free to yell at the screen. So here's the thousand dollar trillion questions extravaganza. Is there another way to go? Because I can't really remember like I've been in there. Can I, you know, go further? Like, I don't think there's anything on that balcony is the funny thing. I don't think there's any doors at all. I think I, well, there's that one, but I don't think that exists, maybe? Well, there's that. I think this might be the place I haven't been kind of up this ways a bit. Oh, come on, jump off the rope. Jump off the goddamn rope. What are you doing? I'm serious. Jump off the rope. What are you doing? Nobody jump backwards? What are you doing? Jump off the sodding rope. Idiot. Okay, let's pretend that didn't happen. And I guess I could have just come up these stairs. So never mind. Okay, let's go over this direction with this nicely curving rail. Yeah. This is the new shit. You just know that that's what it is. Here I am now, possibly in some mansion. Not at all, but I'm on a bridge. Possibly the very bridge I got chucked off of. No, not at all. And there's not even any mushrooms growing in there, but some steam and... I guess I've been here before. Somebody has. This place has lived in. Spooky. Yeah, yeah. Eight? Eh. I guess, I mean, who can put out a torch that high up anyway? Ho, ho, ho. I'm sure there'll be no problem. Your, your, your front of your vest looks like a key there. It's a crotch key. Very, very nice. Very much appreciated. These locks look like they're all frobbed all the time. But I guess they're not. Maybe you're supposed to sort of... Like, I don't think I can take you out from the front, but I'll, I'll try. Oh, I can! Because you weren't alerted and or you're a peasant or frickin' something, I guess. Okay, awesome. I'll just come here, conveniently put you somewhere very, very far from being here. Cause, well, you truly never know how the break in your head and neck are going to both come about. Oh, this is awesome. Oh, 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 look at that view! Look at that window down there. It's incredible. This, this view is just a view. Unless... Uh, Oh, ho, 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 ho. What have we here? Can I break these boards? No, but I can kind of go down under them. Oh, this is cool. And I, as I apparently I'm not going into that bridge place anymore. I've totally changed my mind and have now gone into somebody's bedroom. I know. Just, you know. <coughs> Something doesn't make a sound. Unless, of course, this is all connected. But this looks like some sort of Travelars Inn. Well, it's the Hamelars Inn anyway. Apparently the next version of the Dark Mod will make it so that you can sort of snuff these out without clanking them or freaking something. Anyways, I don't know. A recapitulation of the Lord Builder's principles. 18. Bard thyself. Guard thy... That's not a G. Okay, I'm serious. That's like an M with an upside down reflected M and it's also like a B. Oh. Guard thy... I don't see it. So, from that which is perilous, yet even more from that which is trivial. If thou cannot build a good wall, build it not. 19. Thy measure shall be true if thou stickest to plan. To say it modernly. Yet none can fully know the extent of the world, and better a wall altered than a wall undone. 20. A wall without mass is as light without a shadow. Like invisible barriers do they impede thy progress. 21. Fault lurks in the wall which doth not surround the structure, for through the gaps shall leak foulness. Yeah, well, you know, this guy is smart, he knows his stuff, and now I'm going to make him not so tough. And post a video on YouTube saying, oh, you know what, I'll tell you what you already know, the world's a terrible, terrible place. I'm like, actually, I know the opposite. He's like, oh, no, no, it's not true. Oh, my God, I, I want to hang around with the sewer folks some more. I'm like, hey, 
good, you know, I got over that when I was 12, but hey, power to you. A written briefing. This'll be your task. Wait in your room until the morrow when the hanging is scheduled. See if Scissor Jack is in a fit state to escape, and whether the circumstances permit. If the possibility is open, shoot the noisemakers into the crowd and cover Jack's escape as well as you can. If no opportunity presents itself, send an arrow into Jack's heart before he can say his last words on the scaffold. This is imperative. Better a corpse than a telltale. Should your way be obstructed, let yourself be captured, but do not speak. We will find a way to break you out. X to the Z. All family. Which is a phrase that a lot of musicians say. What? I already had a blackjack. Fool? That's a strange thing. And, and, and it doesn't sound very, like, roll off the tongue-ish, but, like, anyways, you know. Okay. Blackjacks. Okay. Okay. So it's... It's like an alternate... Yeah. So in case I didn't get whatever that other one was, I can come back and get this one. That's... Fantastic, great. I think I may be done here. No tearing of my luscious locks so far. I was gonna post a fun clip of me like going <sighs> with my luscious locks pretending to tear at them in a very, uh, you know, excessively uh, rarity like fashion, but I guess I'm not gonna do that because it sounds like work. Bull. Yeah, okay, I'll get back up to that other place at some point, but you know, first I gotta go into Rotten Flyland. Whoa, this is the shit pit. It's. <laughs> that's, that's amazing. Very nice. Work there? Oh, what? Oh, oh. It's one of those hard to frog things. So I guess the simple key is the key to like every despicable place about town. I, oh, that's interesting. I never knew that was a place. Because, I mean, it's the shit pit. Nobody likes to know about it. All right. And the alchemist. Well, the alchemists are not well thought of in this society. It's too bad, you know. But once they start to turn lead into gold, I guess that's... Backyard key? Did I get the simple key? I don't know. Then, then, then people will, will be ashamed of their mocking and stuff. Dire warning. Magister Enfis, it shall be delivered, but I beg thee to reconsider. The essence of the hemlock is no toy to feed thy snap-tooth lilies. Nay, tis a venom of remarkable potency, which shall cause excruciating pain to whoever might imbibe it. Beware, beware, Enron Fis, a drop misplaced, and the grim reaper shall dance upon thy grave. Look I outside the gibbet and see an eternal reminder. Perhaps thou shouldst find a place akin also. To see is to remember. Lieutenant Emmy Larson. Oh, well, somebody's poisoning somebody. I don't know. I should probably not... It's a breath potion. Definitely not a poison. Oh, there's a poison. Hemlock essence. I should probably not play these when I'm tired so that I can, like, understand. Stirring the, the funky pestle. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, hey. Those locks, they just look wrong. They look self-lit for some reason. And that looks like a cradle face, kind of, but no. Really? So I got some poison. Now, like, am I supposed to... Oh, yeah, I can use that to kill guys, I guess. So it's not as complicated as I thought. Okay, great. But seriously, backyard key. I mean, <laughs> this is a quote-unquote yard. But, uh... So, the simple key is like a skeleton key, kind of, then. Where's the back here? There we go. Interesting. Okay. I'll, I'll see if I could get back up and sort of, like, do my job right. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There, there's a window. What? Hello, my friend. What have we here? Pharmacist's tome. More like the Necronomicon, the greater Syntheticon. Close enough. Volume 1. Many are the seekers of knowledge, but yet more are those who seek it not, for in their heart lurks naught but greed or malice. And here lies the burden of the wise. That which is a cure in one drop might be a venom most insidious in two. Likewise, that which shall heal a man in one mixture shall kill him forthwith in another, without him noticing aught of a difference. The taste most bitter might conceal a remedy, and the sweetest fragments, fragrance an instrument of evil men. Guard then thy knowledge most carefully, for one man's filter is another's poison. Yeah. <laughs> and there's the shit shoot that filters out the stuff. You see, it's got a nice filter on it, so no exhaust fumes will spew over here or over limits. And yeah, I think this is an openable window. Yeah, okay, okay. Right. I can hear someone going, ahem, all the time. Uh. Well, it wasn't you. You look like a dude. I mean, you've got long hair, sure, but let's not be stereotypical up in here. Uh, delicate key. Well, I'm always interested in more keys and wedding rings. Yeah, okay. P 
Hopper is a journalist. He's got a ring, huh? How'd you afford that, huh? Right, stay forth. Uh, are you secretly rich, huh? Jord and Murray got caught by the bailiff's men. Should have listened to Uncle Perry, but did they? The cheeky little ingrates will learn their lessons on the rope. Now, uh, Penitence Day. Saw his lieutenant at talk with the bailiff, and he let the twins get away with it. At least they'll get to learn their lessons at DeWalt's workhouse. Uh, I'd have chosen the gallows if I were in the boy's place. Locksman's Day. Mifflin's is in the neighborhood. I saw the miscreant talking to someone across the flop house. He slipped away by the time I hobbled there, but it was him all right. Mifflin's! I'll finally collect on him one way or another. Forger's Day. You're a pauper, but you collect things. Pfft. Yesterday, Mifflin's. Today, Scissor Jack. He checked into the flop house, and by the time he could get wind of something brewing, I got the bailiff's ears, and he was caught. They'll do a nice job on him, make him dance the hangman's jig. And I got enough out of the deal to buy that fancy ring from the usurer. Lissarl can't say no to me now. I may be an old tipster, but a gold ring is a gold ring. That's the way you treat a human being who is female. <laughs> Time to get Mifflins in the cell across Jack tomorrow. Mason's day. Gilbert the goose and poor foolish Lissarl got hanged. Didn't like my ring and didn't think I'd go to the bailiff with word about her thieving. Dumb little slut serves a- Whoa there, boy. <laughs> whoa, whoa. <laughs> hey, maybe she just likes sex. Mifflin's got clever, though. He slipped away again through a side street. He was in such a hurry, he dropped a key. Might be worth an investigation. At least there are new happenings. The bailiff and Montrose have been all a talk about something. Meanwhile, a builder acolyte and a man from the southern lands have checked into the flop house. Tomorrow I'll learn more to see if I can turn it to my advantage. Is this the key? of my dreams that I have always been looking for and all the time been dreaming about? Could it possibly, possibly be? Uh-oh. My weapon is low. You're no popper, you can afford a sword. Dang it. This delicate key does not unlock the jail. Why would I think it would? Mifflin's isn't the big bad evil guy. I mean, you just... You just don't get to be a big bad evil guy with a name like Mifflin's. Predetermined destiny and all that. Got my finger on the trigger like the son of Sam and all that. Although, I suppose I could try it here. No. Okay, well, never mind that. Playing it wrong. Playing it bad. Playing it incorrect. Oh, this is a really cool secret sort of thing where you can get something that I guess you need. I guess you don't have to kill it with the hemlock. I don't know, maybe you do. Toll. Toll. It's like a toll booth. Why is it a toll booth? It's not a toll booth. Look, it says toll, but it's lying. God. This door being open is suspicious. That can is pointed right at the wall. I guess he's gonna blast it right open as soon as any thief steps his evil, stupid little foolish footsies right into this room and giggles. Because thieves giggling is always a bad sign. Hmm. Just ask Marla Madison. You'd have to start a store instead of being a thief. Oh, I was hoping for a water arrow, but no. This kind of reminds me of the little bit I've played of, uh... F starting fiasco temple. Um, full hearty of the foolish hammerite deadly zombie place. Fitzmeister Cathedral. You guys know what I'm trying to say. That handle is floating off the door, so you know it's mystical. Oh, hey, dude, I'm pressing F4, which cycles through the keys, and this hemlock essence apparently counts as a key. Who knew? Oh, really? Hey, you're gonna come through the door. Oh, he's stuck. Well, that's. <laughs> yeah. You look ridiculous. I'm gonna have to take you out before you cause any trouble. Oh, I acquired a short sword uh, from him, uh, you know, because cutting. That's what a short sword does. It's also what I did so that you couldn't see me take the short sword. Oh, whatever. It's a joke. Okay, now you can come in here. You know, have whatever fun you like. I don't care. I'm gonna dump you out in plain sight. I wanna dump you off the bridge, but. That seems like a bad idea. Oh, this was the bridge I got dumped off of. Oh, I guess that's the toll for the bridge. Okay, cool. I thought that was gonna be a huge, ginormous, freaking highway bridge like that one wavy, wobbly one that we've got in real life up in here somewhere, but no, of course not. I mean, that's just too much to ask for. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. I recognized it. Oh, yeah, I've just I've been in here. That's where I took the guy. Okay, never. Yeah, oh, man. Paths everywhere. Oh, yeah. My most attractive voice yet is that one. And if you want an attractive voice, well, there you What's go. You guys look like you're supposed to be talking. But you're not. Kind of like that one mission in Thief 2, casing or masks or whatever, where they're supposed to be talk but wasn't off. Oh, Nobody's gonna put that out. Of course. 
someone else is going to have to do it. So I bet they won't. Yeah, I mean, you guys are just kind of there. Hey, I bet that's the key on somebody's person. Oh, it's the jail cell key. Should have known it would blatantly say jail cell key. I'm not trying to fool me with, like, delicate key. Because, like, that doesn't make any sense. But, yeah. Hey, delicate key. Maybe it opens a delicate door that doesn't even need a key because it's delicate. Oh, kind of want to knock you out. We all know how that's going to go. Actually, there's a note over there. Just realized. You really want, you, you want, you really want me to, like... Do this, do you? I don't think I can knock you out at all, man. How? Someone How? Is going to have to do it. Is it, oh, am I gonna have to like rush by this fire what in the shadow? Is this note is it like lol? It. Hey, you you got here, but you can't. That's strange. These guys might be supposed to be walking or something. I don't know. Oh well. I was gonna say like some sort of catchphrase, like I'm killing you with a weapon there, but give me a break. Yep. Take it. So evidence. That sounds bloody important. But hey, never mind. I guess it's completely not. All right, all right, all right. That's an well, old noise. Sure is. Oh wait, I can get down here with not one but two ladders. Come on. Really? What was that sound? Oh, you guys. Well, at least I can run away and hide here. That's that's a. That's a good deal for Britain. Okay, evidence to the Honorable Archibald Flint. By now, my courier must have brought you this grail of regrets you have been looking for. Concern yourself not with the fate of its previous owner. I have it on good authority he has suffered an unfortunate accident. <laughs> I would like you to consider the grail a gift, a token of my goodwill, if you like. My friend the bailiff also assures you of his best intentions and recommends that we should sit down and assess the possibilities of collaboration on the territory between Fiddler's Hill and our turf. As you will surely understand. So. Or find evidence about his work. Uh, but I probably had to do that, though, didn't I? So. Come on. Is this or is this not? Oh, it is. Okay, good. I'll just leave those two to bicker in private. Dribble their saliva all over the floor. Oh, that's great. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> I guess this mission is kind of hard-ish. I don't know, man. It's not that bad. Hey, I love how loot can be bumped around. That ought to be used more often in missions. Oh, boy. Dog. Yeah. Okay, so they're never going to find me up here. <laughs> I'm lying in bed. They're never going to find me lying in bed. Telling the truth in bed, yeah, but liars always, always, always escape with their teeth. Alrighty, well, now that I'm in super safe land, I think I'm going to leave it here. So see you guys next time. Actually, before I see you guys next time, just going to see if there's anything up in the attic. I guess there's that vent over there. So that could be a way out because maybe I don't have a key for this door, huh? Okay, well, now that I'm in safe land, see you guys next time. Bye for now.